These are a bunch of books that we're making for 21 icons. Nadine Gordimer is the subject of this shoot, and um, so we're going to get her sitting up on these books. Heavy, it's about 20 kilograms. Just stand it this way and then, um, then we can actually just push it down. We slightly underestimated the size of the books, I suppose. I, I just hope that she's got some kind of foot ladder in her house. Um, they're big books. I'm wondering how we're going to stack these things. This is going to be so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Having a big book issue. <laughs> okay, one. We're loading the them in. Yeah, this one's Taking a while. We've had to get another car. Oh, guys. Oh, hold on. It's perfect, man. Beat me up, Scotty. <laughs> Is that the bell? I don't know. Fingers crossed once she sees her room's been cleared of all the furniture and there's been replaced with five enormous books. It's not an easy frame. Yeah, the frame itself. So you just pull the books around more into this way. So that that's coming in. Don't try that. Okay. I think the books need to go outside. Oh. Let's get all the books out here. Yeah. Now. Is it 85 mil? Adrian's changed his mind. We were due for Nadine to arrive five minutes ago. We had it all set up inside. And now Adrian said the room's too small, so we have moved the books to outside. Nadine Gordimer is a strong-minded, highly intelligent woman. <laughs> you right? Are you comfy? Yes. Well, not the best thing in the world, <laughs> but it's all right. I have just come to the crisis of having to give up the typewriter. They don't make the right ribbon anymore. And I have bought a computer. What computer did you get? I better not give the name, given the free advertisement. Just as long as she doesn't take. <laughs> Talk about mug shots. It's, a, it's an amazing portrait. You've got Nadine Gordimer, the most sort of significant literary woman on the continent, sitting on her own books, like something out of Alice in Wonderland. It's, it, it is extraordinary. Right, that must be enough now. <laughs> Hasn't anybody else objected to the R word? No, you're the only one who's objected oh. to being celebrated. <laughs>